When my daughter was born, she, she had a neurological condition. It's a very rare one. It's called alternating hemiplegia of childhood. One day, she can't move anything in her body, full body paralysis. And then maybe a couple days later, it'll be on the right side of her body. Come on. You got it, come on. My area of uh, research is in medical uh, image analysis. In a computer science sense, uh, we build the software that basically mimics a radiologist. We're actually describing your brain as a network. More specifically, as a network that is organized and maybe in a particular way. Is it organized in the healthy way? Or is it potentially organized in an abnormal way? The real question then becomes, specifically for things that are in children, how fast can we find this abnormality? Can we find it at six months old? If we can, great. It means that one, we have identified that this child has this very specific type of disorder, right? And two, because of that, the clinician now can say, we need to start therapies. We could do a tremendous amount of information gathering that was really impossible, you know, five, ten years ago. When Maddie was about one, I just decided, if she can't do it, I will. So I decided, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start doing some of these races. And I decided, you know what? I'm gonna take her wheelchair out there. I'm gonna push her in her wheelchair for a 5K and we're gonna run it together. And since she can't really talk, right, she, she giggles a lot. So I could tell she's just really, really enjoying it. I try to, to help out and contribute and that's how I keep positive and I keep going. You know, I don't lose hope and, and just believe life will find a way. And, huh, that's my secret sauce right there. <laughs>